be a way to make gardening more high octane. Next planting season, let's plant poison ivy, brambles, and cacti. We'll make it an obstacle course. Ooh, can jellyfish live in a pond? Not everything has to be fast, loud, or dangerous to be an adventure. Touche. Is that why you're planting stuff on top of each other when there's plenty of room? Some kind of garden variety of gymnastics? We planted complementary vegetation that grows in a symbiotic relationship, so we need them close. See how the corn stalks make a natural bean pole? And the squashes protect the roots. What are you doing to that squash? Oh, this is Melvin. Why should pumpkins have all the fun? That's different. Which reminds me, where's Sammy? Peek-a-boo! Oh! <gasps> Sammy! You startled us, you corn stalker. It's my latest costume creation. <laughs> Dig it? I do, but your zombie chef costume is still my favorite. I want Sammy to make me a sheep costume. Because I'm a wolf, get it? I'd be a wolf in sheep's clothing? Logically, that would mean that you'd still be dressed up as a wolf. So is it a costume at all? Ooh, that's a thinker. Think later, Sammy. Our wolf stones are lit to the great wolf geyser. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. I knew this costume was scary. Sammy's scare squirrel strikes again. What's up, Cascade? Doing a little gardening? We just were, too. Yes, indeedy. Um, Cascade, why would you water water lilies? Emotional support. I so get that. Where's the Great Wolf Spirit sending us today? Let's dip in and find out. Those look like stars. Are we going to space? Don't ask me. I just work here. Highly improbable, due to gravity. Gravity? Gravity. Why does that sound so familiar? I do enjoy tea. I always wanted to go to space. We're not going to space. Only one way to know for sure. something, the gravity. The Great Wolf Spirit told me you'll need it reversible. Reversible gravity? Impossible. <laughs> no, just magical. When you want, turn your wolf stone to change the orientation of your own gravity. Amazing. Whoa! That is awesome! 
Ah, shucks. Thanks. <laughs> Did you know she could do that? Uh-uh. Have fun. Gotta flow. Cascade! We still don't know where we are! You're in Kaleidoscope Caves. Who are the Globats? What are... I mean, who are you? My name's Phosphorus. What kind of bats are you? Where are your wings? Oh! We're the Great Wolf Pack. Oh, you're Topsiders! What are all these lights? The ones underhead? Glowworms. Want to see our town? That hole you fell into used to be the community amphitheater where I did drama club. Alas, our big pre-hibernation talent show just weeks away when it erupted. Lava? No, water, like a geyser. Then my dad, he's sheriff, blocked it off. It was my favorite place. Sorry to hear that, kid. I'm sure it'll be fixed up better than new. Not till the Miramoles and Globats stop arguing over it. Welcome to Batburg. Whoa. This is our main street, Globat Boulevard. Need a place to stay? There's the Hang Inn. They have the best grubs. You mean the best grub, as in food? No, no, real grubs. They got fried grubs, grub witches, grub ice cream. Mm. Got anything without grubs in it? <laughs> Seriously? Gross? No way. Sorry, by topsiders, do you mean any of us who live above ground? Yes, ma'am, but it's really just the mere moles most Globats have a problem with. Our above-ground neighbors are burrowers, and they pop through our floorboards. I'm not supposed to talk to them, but... I don't see what the big deal is. A few potholes here and there, but... Ooh. What was that? They got it! Oh! Come on! We broke control! Yeah, yeah, again! Stop right there! Lousy mirror mole, get up there. We better mark this as another drop zone. Where's my patch patrol? Here, Sheriff Sulphur. Oh, look at him go. They have done this before. Hold on now, what do we got here? Some kind of gigantic furry bugs or something? Yeah, it's a pleasure to meet you, Sheriff. We're the Great Wolf Pack. Never heard of you. They're topsiders, Pop, uh, but it's okay. They're here to help. If I told you a thousand times, Phosphorus, never trust a topsider. Sir, I'm a bear, so I've seen some nice caves, but this? Mwah. Oh, well, thank you kindly. Yeah, we do pride ourselves in having the darkest, dankest cave around these parts. Nice work. Thanks. Sheriff, we'd like to help. May we see your building plans? Kaleidoscope caves are a popular tourist spot. We need more low-rise apartments and hotels, affordable homes and places for bats to stay, you know? The sinkhole we saw was here. Do you have a cross-section of the soil depths? No, sirree. We need access to the topsiders' turf for all that. Have you tried talking to the mere moles about the problem? There ain't no talking to them brutes. Dad, I'm sure the mere moles don't mean any harm. Oh, we'll find a solution, Sheriff. You have my word as a record. See, mere moles is nothing but non-stop troublemakers. A little help here? You're getting stuck, stranger. It's gonna take a crane to free you. From your head side, that is. It's your tail side I'd worry about. What do you mean? Well, I wouldn't want my hindquarters on display on mere mole Main Street. Mm -hmm. oh, no, 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 no. Stay back. I may be the only thing keeping the whole street from collapsing. What? 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 We need to learn the depth of the ground around here. If it's thin, the wrong move could trigger an earthquake. Then we'll have to work from both sides at once, like it or not. It's too dangerous. Sorry, Sheriff, but we're going up to meet the Miramol Mayor. Wait, down? The uh, point is, Oliver, we're gonna get you free. So stay put, mister. I'll stay here with you. We can enjoy the scenery together. And I'll go with the others. Phosphorus, no. It's too dangerous. Dad, you have to let me spread my wings a little. Besides, I'm the only one who can lead them there. They don't even have sonar. Oh. Well, I reckon I'll keep an eye on things here while we set up to pull them like a bad tooth. No offense. None taken. Miramol Valley's right up ahead. 
Let's go, Pack. Time to turn those wolf stones. Giant monsters came strolling into your yard, you'd hide too. Whoa, whoa. A little harsh there. I, I wouldn't call us monsters. Wait till you meet Mayor Metal. She's really unfriendly. Huh. You sure know a lot about Mirmole Valley for being enemies. Let's just say my dad and I don't exactly hear ear to ear on that. what they're saying. Oh, they're just trying to figure out if your tails are furry snakes clamped onto your butts. Hey! <laughs> Come on, guys. We gotta find Oliver. He could be anywhere. Wow, I've got to get sonar. Come on, let's go. Sammy, you're covering my eyes. By the power vested in me by being voted mayor, I command you to stop. <laughs> mayor Muddle. We're the Great Wolf. A raccoon rug bursts through the ground in the middle of my town. Then a Globat brat turns up with a gang of furry freaks. Oh, why am I not surprised? Well, I don't know. Maybe you should see a doctor. <sighs> Want to play another round of 20 questions? Oh, let's make it twice as hard. 40 questions. That would not make it harder. <laughs> my feet. Looks like your friends reached the other side. That or something big's about to eat your feet first. Wiley! <laughs> oh, he's okay. Auntie, I mean Mayor, your temporary office is ready! You're the sheriff's kid. Does your father know you're here? He sent me, ma'am. And we're here to help. Step out to my office. Not you, Officer Digby. You get the construction form all down here. And keep an eye on that. Now stay with Oliver. He looks fun. Good idea, Sammy. Oliver should have one of us at his side. Sides. I think it's pretty clear why the Great Wolf Spirit sent us. The GWS knew Oliver's butt would cause a traffic jam in two towns? No, it... It, what? We're supposed to make peace between these neighbors. Oh, I knew that. You passed my test. Are you batty? You can't be here. No one can see us together. I want everyone to see. We deserve to hang out openly. No more secrets. No flying back there! Once again, the puny-brained Globat city planning is hurting innocent mammals. Uh, I'm standing right here. Can I see those blueprints? With all due respect, Mayor Muddle, it is a two-way street. We can't build new homes because you're burrowing through our floors. <laughs> Us? Oh, tell your dad to get that giant fir tree out of Mirmole Valley. Sorry, Mayor, but you may have to work together on this one. Molly? In such matters, I defer to my niece, Molly Muddle. She's studying civil engineering. Wow! Here's the problem! By overlaying these blueprints, the topography shows the soil density. Looks like if your communities will just communicate, your sinkhole days are over. But if you won't, then... Then you're sunk. We better go show these plans to Oliver. Interesting. Very interesting. Hmm. Yes, I can dig it. Bad boy, take a copy of this to the sheriff and tell him we mere moles agree to work together to get that massive opossum out of our roads on the condition we all stay on our own sides. 
Maybe if we can make them see working together works, they'll mend fences, not just holes. Initiate Operation Oliver. Jeez. Come on. What are we waiting for? The mayor's orders. Oliver, if you can hear me, move your left foot in. Good. Now, move your left foot out. Put your left foot in, and you shake it all about. <laughs> Sammy, it's not nice to trick Oliver into doing the hokey pokey. Aww, but that's what it's all about. Help's on the way, Oliver. He's really mad or really hungry. <laughs> These grubs are delicious. Is your friend okay? Oh, yeah. Right, Ollie? <laughs> oh, fine piggies. He's fine. Is the excavator here? Even better than that. A patch patrol just brought in the good old pension push. Take a look at these. <laughs> Just as I thought, we can do this. But we need supports on both sides, or the road will collapse. Begin the extraction! Are they starting? If they're starting, we're starting. Uh, no, 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 don't start. Uh, look at the plans. What's the problem? If we put pressure here and the glow bats push there, the whole street could collapse. Oh, mud pies! What shall we do? Communicate before it's too late. How? Send a messenger, Snail. Too slow. I got this. Violet, Sammy, please tell your friend to suck in his gut. <laughs> no, I can do that. Here I come, Oliver. <laughs> tickle, tickle, tickle. <laughs> <laughs> I'm winging it. There's a structure here with too much weight to break ground. Excellent observation. We'll need me to turn around and push myself up, down, and out. Stop right there! Cease and desist! They're communicating! Mayor Muddle, let's get out of this mess and get on with our lives. For once we agree. This great wolf pack is a great big pain. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what? After all we've done, these enemies bond over us being the problem? Hey, whatever works. Muddle, what we got here is what you call a sticky situation. Maybe not sticky enough if you catch my drift. Brilliant, Sulphur. Officer Digby, get the fire hose! Go bats, mud flat formation. Ready or move? Ready below. Three, two, one. Bad glow bat. You too, Mirror Mole. You two make quite a team. Imagine what you could do together if this wasn't a one-time thing. Yeah, like fix that old theater. Hey, that, that space, space is ours. ours. Lousy topsiders. Gross undergrounders. Stop, Stop it. fighting. Phosphorus sulfur. Molly muddle. <sighs> Young love, so innocent yet so sneaky. Wiley means love of the theater, don't you, Wiley? Yes? I love theater. Also love the circus. I also love the flying trapeze artists. Same. Here's an idea. How about we all work together, rebuild the theater, and you can take turns using it? Hmm. That would offset the costs. Exactly. And cut down labor time. 
And we are nocturnal while... We're not! It's so crazy. It just, just might, might work. work. Yes! Come on, everybody. Let's do this! to y'all. That's a mighty fine looking community theater. Looks like show's over for us too. This may be our most festive fall feast yet, thanks to our harvest. It all looks delicious. Please pass the everything. Wait, we can't start without Sammy. Oh, where is Sammy? Good one, Sammy. You got us. Now please never do that again. I never found my sunflower seeds. I don't recall planting sunflowers. Sometimes nature is magic like that. Just 